Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. I um, am excited for today's video. This is going to be like a classic like day in my life vlog, especially now that I'm a 2L. Um, so I'll show you what a day in my life as a 2L is like. Um, but I feel like I need to give an explanation. I was gone for a few months. Um, yeah, there's really no good reason why. I just had like a really busy summer. I had so much stuff going on and I'm back now. Um, so yeah, I basically started this school year. Okay, a few major things have happened. One, as you would have seen, I adopted a dog. She's sitting with me on the couch. Millie, come here. Her name is Millie. She's very sweet. I love her a lot. I adopted her this summer while well, I was a summer associate in July, and she's actually an incredibly well-behaved dog. We have a few things that we're working on, like training and different uh, other issues that we've had, but she's housebroken, and I'm so happy to have her here. It's made the start of my semester a little bit nicer to come home to someone every day. Um, what else? I moved apartments, as you can see. I am still working on like furnishing it. I'm sure you will see it more in the videos. Furnishing an apartment is like so expensive, so I've been trying to do it like over time so that it's not like thirty thousand dollars all at once. Not that it's thirty thousand dollars, but you like you know what, you know what I mean. Um, so that's the other thing that has been happening, uh, like organizing, getting everything together, um, and what else? Yeah, I feel like that's everything. Too well has been going really well. My classes are way less stressful. I'm sure, as you'll see today, my schedule is less hectic, um, and like things are just really working out for the best. Um, so yeah, today I have two classes and I have a meeting with someone in the clerkship office because I'm going to be applying for clerkships at the end of the year. And yeah, just like doing work, getting my life together. So, okay, this is what I want to know. My hair, I'm not sure about. So I've been, I've always had wavy hair and like I know that, but I just use heat tools to like get rid of the wave. But I was like, oh, maybe I'll try to embrace the wave. So I like used some like curly hair products, but I think it just kind of looks not, I don't know what to think of it. Anyways, that's my other adventure that I've been going on. Um, so yeah, I was actually really sick last week. Um, yeah, I don't know. I was just unwell. So I'm kind of getting over that still, catching up, like trying to feel good. Um, but I think I'm going to go back to the gym today. I couldn't go this morning because Marcella had stuff going on and we always go together. Um, but yeah, I'll take you along with me today. And I'll stop rambling now. Okay, so I have finished my oatmeal. I've just been doing the New York Times crossword and like reading the news as I do every morning. Um, and I'm gonna start on my to-do list that you saw me make. I actually don't have a ton going on today, which is kind of nice so I can focus on things outside of the reading that I have to do. But the first thing that I'm gonna do is just finish my reading for the week. I only have one left and it is for my inclusion and exclusion in American law class, which is not a seminar, but it is like a smaller discussion-based class um, where we're discussing like the history of the US and like the laws and who has been included and excluded throughout the time. Um, so we're finished our, we're, we're, this week is our unit on um, basically like the Native American population and indigeneity and like who has been included, what have the laws been. Um, so I'm gonna finish my reading for that and then go from there. Okay, so I've just finished my reading. So I'm done with all of my readings for the week, which is a great feeling on a Tuesday. Um, it actually wasn't bad. It was only one case and then two articles, but not even a full article, like portions of articles. Um, and not like academic articles, like from a news site article. So it was pretty chill. Um, so I decided it's 10 o'clock. Instead of doing more work, 
I'm going to get on some of the tasks that I need to get done that I've been putting off. So I need to make sure that my electricity is changed. Like I'm, I'm being billed for this house, not my old house. Um, I need to get my forms to the registrar and like basically I have loans from undergrad that I need to pause every school year to like re-up that I'm in school. So I need to do that. It's like my least favorite activity. It's always a hassle. Like they, I just like don't understand. They never believe that I'm in law school. I'm like, I assure you I'm in law school. Like I shouldn't be charged for these loans. Um, like they should be paused while I'm in school and it's always a disaster. Um, so I need to do that, which I've really been putting off. Um, and yeah, then maybe I'll do some tidying before I head over to school for my classes. So going to work on those things now. Okay, so before I head off to school, I'm going to cook, make myself my lunch. I'm making myself these like Caesar, so I have a pre-made Caesar salad and then some chicken. I also have some tomatoes over there. And then I have wraps that I need to get out of the fridge. I'm gonna make myself like a Caesar salad wrap and then bring some fruit and like some snacks. So I don't usually do a lot of chores on the weekdays just because I'm like literally so busy I cannot, I just don't have time. But because I've like moved in as things have been arriving to my home. Here, let me put you down. Um, as things have been arriving to my home, I've been like setting them up, getting things together. So I've been doing a lot more like chores on the weekdays, especially because I have more time than I'm not a 1L. Um, so I have like a few minutes. I'm just gonna hang up some of my laundry. I love my new closet It is so large. I am so happy. I just got this dresser built. My boyfriend came and built it for me I'm very grateful. It took him so long um, But yeah, just going to hang up some of my stuff now And now it is time to take Millie for a walk. Let me see if she recognizes. I'm not sure she knows the word yet. Where'd she go? Oh, she's going under the couch. Um, but I'm gonna take her for a walk. So this way while I'm at school, hopefully she can just be tired and sleep. I always feel so bad leaving her because she just wants to hang out with me and I leave her. So yeah, we're gonna go for a little walk. Eating lunch with Susan and Marcella. <laughs> Very appetizing. Welcome to Tulum. <laughs> okay, so I want to tell you all about like my clerkship meeting, my day at school. I just walked home, so I'm back now. Um, except like I hired someone to come and clean my apartment because I was sick last week. I was just like, I just want someone else to clean it. Like, I can't be bothered. It's such a mess. Um, and they never responded. Like I had said, this time would be good for me. Um, but no one responded. So I was like, okay, whatever. I'll reschedule. I'll figure it out. And then they just called me and they're like, oh, we're like three minutes away. Like, how do you want us to come? Uh, so I've just like panicked because I have the dog here. I like don't have anywhere else to go. So I'm figuring it out. Um, because like obviously I don't want to be here while they're cleaning um, but yeah figuring it out gonna update you once I figure out where to take Millie and myself okay I am homeless wait let me change this okay I'm homeless because I let the cleaning team into my home um, we're not going to the gym and I'm just sitting in Marcella's home and she has kindly fed me <laughs> kindly fed me edamame as I sit here very stressful. 
<laughs> Best friends. Millie and Marcella on the ground. Yeah, Millie. Aw, so cute. She's a therapy dog, so. Yeah, in training. <laughs> Okay, I'm back home. So we didn't end up going to the gym just because this afternoon was so hectic. Basically, I had Crim Pro, then I had admin, and then I went to the clerkship meeting, which was actually really good. He like reassured me that like I'm doing the right things to like get a clerkship. I feel good about it. Just like, you know, I, I was told to raise my GPA a little bit, which is, you know, it is what it is, but something a little stressful. Anyways, um, but then like all this like cleaning team stuff and like honestly they didn't even do that good of a job like i just got home um and i'm kind of annoyed about it like they didn't wipe down my desk i feel like that and then like they mopped the floors but there's like boot marks everywhere anyways i shouldn't complain but i am going to anyways because that's who i am anyways so i'm exhausted i'm like kind of frustrated with everything that happened this afternoon but i've made myself dinner i have some pasta, this is the Allison Roman pasta that was like very famous during COVID, and some broccoli. And I'm going to sit here and enjoy this meal and get back to work later. Okay, it's been a hot minute, but I sat down on my couch and I was like, oh, I'm just gonna relax. Like, I'm gonna watch some YouTube videos. Like this afternoon was so stressful. Um, I'll watch TV. But then I started working on my law review assignment. Um, so my law review assignment for like an overview is just, um, people are publishing articles in our journal that we have selected and my assignment for this like set of assignment periods um is to go ahead and like find all of the sources that they use so basically go and find copies of it and put it in a folder which sounds easy but it's not um like it's less easy than it sounds because you have to format it in a certain way you have to make sure it's readable make sure you have a link that will always be preserved um to get you back to the source um, some sources are only available in a book, etc., etc. So I was kind of stressed because I know that it's the type of thing that's going to take a while. Um, so I started on that. So I, for this article, the article is like many, many pages and they have hundreds of footnotes. So I'm assigned 45 footnotes and I did five of them and it wasn't so bad, especially now that I know what I'm doing. Like this is how you document everything, how you keep track of everything. Um, so I felt pretty good about that. Um, and I got kind of into it, you know, like I got in a flow. So yeah, it shouldn't be too bad. Hopefully you can get some more done over the course of this week. And yeah, I'm going to go take Millie for a little walk. Hopefully it's not pouring rain out. And yeah, I have to get an early night because I'm going to the gym like really early tomorrow um, because we didn't make it today. Gotta go tomorrow. Okay, I have gotten ready for bed. Excuse how red my skin is. I did my skincare routine and this always happens. Um, I also have my retainers in, so that's why I'm lisping. Um, but before I sign off for the day, I just wanted to say that me and my friends are going to be filming another, like, things we wish we'd known video. Um, but, like, reflecting our on our entire one all year. The last video I did with all of them was, like, really popular. And we had a really fun time filming it, so we want to do another one. Um, but, yeah, if you have any questions or, like, things that you want us to address... I think we're planning on talking about like job interviews, OCI, big law, etc. Um, leave them in the comment box below. We'll be sure to get to them. And I hope you guys have a good rest of your day. Thank you so much for watching this video. And I'm excited to bring you guys more content over the course of the rest of my 2L year. So yeah, bye everyone.